Hey guys, welcome back to the Let's Play of Pikmin with KK and Ardwick of the Net. Cool. <laughs> well, after having a gruesome but uh, quite fun day at the Forest of Hope, we're going to be tackling pretty much one of the last areas in Pikmin, which is called the Distant Spring. Hooray! It is a huge area to say the least. Uh, it has 10 ship parts and it's mainly filled with lots of puzzles, lots of water hazards, and lots of new enemies, actually. Yes, it is. So let's... It started today. On day nine. Are you looking forward to this? Well, I actually am because it has nice music and it's a nice change from the other levels because this one contains the most water. Oh, it's a wonderfully serene place. It's oh, it is. It's just difficult. It's a, it's so massive. It's an evil monster of a level. And there's water hazards everywhere. Exactly. And right off the bat, we're gonna probably get. Uh, I'm probably gonna say 40 Pikmin. 40 blue Pikmin. Blue cheese, excuse me. Blue Interesting. Cheese. Blue cheese Pikmin, yes. Yes, pretty much. Uh, there's one ship part that's very easy to get right next to the ship. Oh, the, oh, the key? Yes. Yeah. Now, you don't need all 40, you need just about 25 to 30 of them, but some uh, could fail and just fall off in the meantime, so you just want to be extra careful sometimes. As they often do, yes. As they often do, we're all filled with epic fail today. So let's get going. Now, technically, you could take yellows here and throw them up on that ledge where the next ship part is, but uh, it's just easier with the blues because they have to carry it back into water anyway. Now, you want to be very careful here, too, because they have to get next to the key. I found the repair type bolt. This robotic marble can fix just about anything in the ship that's broken. Now that's handy. That's good because I got terribly bored fixing little budgets. Now you'd think. Bam! Good God, man! I love it. Now you now you'd think that that this piece alone would solve your all of your problems if it, it's supposed to fix everything. Yeah, but apparently, uh, it's just there also for fun and crap and giggles. I, it's a cool looking device. It's cool. Now here's the remaining two Pikmin that I want to... Three. Well, there was, we had one with us, but... Oh. Yeah. So let's put these guys away. So pretty much, we don't really need blue Pikmin that much for the rest of the day. You're kidding. You know, I'm not really kidding. We're pretty much going to run with reds and yellows. Now, there's going to be some new bosses just up ahead, and they are very, very tough. Oh dear. So we're going to take 60 red Pikmin. We're going to take out the yellows in just a second. The, Man, I'm so sorry, guys. I meant to say mustard. Yeah, we haven't been consistent with that. We haven't been systematically correct in our grammar. Oh, dear. Well, sadly, the repair type bolt did not show up on the ship. But it's oh, in there dear. somewhere. Yep. This looks like an ordinary bolt, but it is actually a repair robot. A robot? No, a robot my butt. Okay, we've got 20 p ship parts, so we're doing quite nicely. For today, we only really need... Um, oh, dear. Yes. I saw that. Yeah, I saw it too. For this day, we really... Actually, you know what? Let's keep... Let's pull away 10. 10 ish. And let's get the rest of them into yellows. Then the blues haven't done them yet. Uh, get inside the end. Now, we're not very uh, impacted on time as we were in Forest of Hope and Forest of Naval because we're going to be spending roughly four days here. Now, oh, these wow. two new enemies. Let's take care of the Puffy Blowhawk first. This is the Puffy Blowhawk. It is one mean enemy. Pretty much what it does, if it do, can come do not, over do not, here, you have to walk away from it and let it lure it to you. Yeah. Do not have it hover over the uh, the big guy. Yeah. yeah I'll you're, explain you're, what you're that guy is stuff. in just a second. If we can get him to fall down, come on, come on, come we on. We need to throw more on him. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's gonna go! Yeah! Pretty much what it does is uh, just blow air currents at your Pikmin and deflower them and blow them everywhere. Now, oh. we got a bunch of nice uh, pellets, but at this point in the stage, we don't need them. Now, here is the Spy Ball Bear, a much tougher version of the regular Spotty Ball Board. But it, it didn't show, though. We, yeah, it didn't stand much of a chance if you well, overwhelm it. Well, oh. Ah, and we have our next, one of my favorite, actually, enemies in Pikmin 1. This is the Swooping Snitch Bug. Oh, it is I, pretty I much, hated these things. I love them just because of the way they make sounds and how they... They don't kill Pikmin, they just take Pikmin that are in your army and throw them into random places, and they uh, just put them in the ground. Mm -hmm. So they're not really bad, they're just somewhat annoying. Yeah, my, my favorite enemies in this game, it's either the Pup Stool or the uh, the Flying Blowhog. Uh, I think, just because of how cool they look. They're, they're really fun true. enemy designs. I really do like the Puff Stool, but I like the Swooping Stench Bug just a little more. Actually, my favorite boss to be quite uh, 
to be perfectly honest with you, is one of the optional bosses that is actually located right here. Oh, that thing. Yes, that thing. Now, as you can see here, this is uh, kind of like crater or rocks or whatever. This is another form of, I guess you can say, where nectar is found. Another form of hidden grass. Let's get more picking working now. Come on. You can only have so many on them at a time, though. Uh, now, we're already one-fourth of the way through the day, but um, you know what? Let's call these guys back. Now, here is the first rock wall that we need to take care of. Come on, guys. We don't need that many, but I don't think it's enough. I need to, we need six. So as far as my favorite boss goes, yeah, that's I right. think my favorite boss is the the blow uh, the, uh, the puff stool actually. Really? Yeah, because of the, well, you it's didn't so see it. It's so puffy. It, it, I hate you, puffy. But more seriously, I think it's actually a neat idea because it um it can make enemies out of your um out of your army. Okay. Plus, it's now really we have to be very careful about that Wally Wog, as you can see there. It's a different version of the Wally Wog that's found actually in the uh, Forest Naval. Those those were white Wally Wogs, and this is the yellow Wally Wog. It's just bigger and tougher. Looks like an egg. A yellow egg. Oh god. Uh oh. Go. Nice. Oh, okay, that was close. I actually, uh, in the meantime, since the Forest Naval perfected the timing on avoiding the death attack, so we won't lose many. Oh, dear. Oh, but these are evil monsters. These are called Cheerwits. I think we saw them in the Forest Naval, though. We did. Now, what's an interesting fact that's not known in the uh, Forest Naval is that when Cheerwits fly over water, they actually lose health, surprisingly. I don't know why, because normally if a creature flies, it gains uh, endurance, I guess. Maybe it's the moisture. Maybe. Well, well, well. Okay, so now that we have uh, that first bridge taken care of, let's actually put away some of our reds. Let's actually get some more uh, red Pikmin and yellow Pikmin. Yeah, I'd say just collect just all the stuff around here that's just lying around so that it doesn't go yeah, to waste. Exactly. Now, at this point in the stage, it's really actually doesn't make much sense to collect Pikmin because we have all the Pikmin that we'll ever need. You have time and the resources are there. There's no reason why you shouldn't collect them. True. But I'm not, you know, a big fan of just collecting random stuff. I am. Yes. We already got that message, Olimar, for the third time. It actually drives me nuts. Maybe it's just because I'm greedy, but it drives me nuts when I see people leaving, leaving perfectly good spoils and not picking them up, even though there's no reason not to. I do that in dungeons in Pikmin 2. If For all you guys that play Pikmin 2 or have played it, uh, you know what I'm talking about, just for the for the money work. But in Pikmin 1, once you have a, about 150 of each Pikmin, you don't really need any. Eh, true. I just like to be on the uh, on the safe side with Pikmin sometimes, just in case we lose some. We have 182 reds, that's more than enough. Okay, it's never uh, enough. Now, normally... These are the reds who fail to pick up things. They're the ones that were left behind, almost. So sad. Okay, so actually, let's pull away all the reds and get more blues. Boing. What are you doing? Getting more yellows. And... How do you get more? Oh, yeah. Oh, I go into the onion. Oh, you said blues, so and blues, more yellows and blues. Oh, more mustard and blue cheese for our hot dog. I'm hungry right now. Then. <laughs> uh, now we need actually a lot. Of I'd say just mac maximize it. Yeah, you're right. Now, while they're working on that bridge, uh, it'll take them some time. We're going to be going after another bridge, which is actually located in this general direction. Now, the hard part is that it's stopped, stopped by Wally Wogs everywhere, so it's going to be a little pain in the ass for us. But, I don't think it's too much for these little Pikmin to handle. Just swarm him! Okay, uh, run! Dang, that was close. And dead! Not bad. So much for trying to kill us, little froggy. Okay, there should be some Shearwigs over here. Oh, yes. Wow. Good call. Now, sadly for this little guy, he's dead. Bam. Sadly. Sadly for him. Dead. Oh, for him, yes. Bam. One hit KO. Almost one hit KO. <laughs> they couldn't stand a chance. Now, what's a little annoying is that these guys are gonna, in attempt to carry it back, but we're not gonna allow. Let's work on the bridge. This is actually a very important bridge, to say the least. Reason being is that on this little island over here, there's not only one ship part, but there's actually a ton of skulls that contain bomb rocks and a spotty ball bear just for our uh, oh, enjoyment. Okay. So while these guys are going to be working on this bridge, let's see how the other blue picker they're doing. I'm a little nervous leaving them here, but you uh, know that'll what? be fine. I think so too. Oh, uh, so 
Hey, one bridge like, is done. It sounds like they finished actually. That that's that was probably them. Yeah, good timing. Okay, so let's see. Where are you guys? I know you're here somewhere. To your left. There we go. Should we have enough for this? Yes, I'm pretty sure. So, no, you do not have enough for this. Oh, great. Well, they'll be stuck here anyway. I think this thing takes like 40. I agree with you. The gluon drive. Using the quark binding metaphysical properties of gluons, this device, well, it's very scientific. I don't fully understand it myself, but it's very expensive. Really, Omar? Oh, God. 50. Whoa! So, well, they're going to be waiting here for the remaining blue Pikmin. This is going to be the second part that we're going to get today. If we're lucky, we'll get three, but we don't need to today. I'd say go for it if you can. And that's what I'm going to try and do, but we're going to be spending four days here anyway, so... Hello, you're a dead snake bug. <sighs> we'll actually give that to the yellows just because. Just because. Okay. Just because? Yes. Give him some stupid volley logs too, just to... Well, we're going to need him for the uh, bomb rocks, but I want these guys uh, to finish. Oh, right, right, yeah. So, in the meantime, we'll take... Hmm. Actually, you know what? Let's see. Let's disband these guys. Come on, move faster, move faster, gotta go faster. Like Pokemon. Okay, gotta oh. catch them all. Okay, with these Pikmin, we gotta be very careful not to wake up the Spy Ball Bear. Okay, we're gonna come back here when we have more reds. But in the meantime... Nope. No, oh, there no. they are. Moo! No, none left. Okay, have some fun here. No. I, I just hear them saying, uh, yay. Yay. Yay! Like Yahoo! That, I never heard boo. I hear. I, I sometimes hear Yahoo. Yahoo! Lag. So, sounds like one syllable to me. Wow, that's uh, a lot of lag. That was a lot of lag. Okay, and surprisingly, we have a lot of uh, leaf pigment, so we're gonna have to turn them into at least bud or if not flower ones soon. So divide. Okay. Grab now a whole with crap the, ton of yellows. Well, but, I mean, the ones with bomb rocks specifically. Yeah. Now, this is going to be a very important rock ball to destroy later on. Oh, There's wow. a lot oh, of... Oh, there! Oh, God! Can they, pick up one... Can they pick up one of bombs? Oh! oh! Apparently so. That was not good. Oh, God, that's not good. Oh, nuts. Really? Bad. That swooping stitch bug is actually getting to be a little pain in the See ass. what I mean? I hate those sons of bitches. Okay. Well, that's about as good as you got... Oh, wait, no, you have Yeah. Uh oh Oh no! He's stuck on the other side, actually. I'm just you gonna know, get You might there. have to leave him there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to probably leave him there, sadly. Alright, no, no, you can go around. This death won't be in vain. We'll get him later in the game. Yeah. We need to get the glue on drive, though. So let's worry about that first. Okay. And actually, in the meantime. Well, no. Well, you know what? We'll let the glue carry back that stuff. We don't need too many. We already have 51 in our group. Obnoxious snitch bugs. Obnoxious. In obnoxious indeed. Okay, let's get moving. So apparently, I, I thought it was like 30 or 40, but apparently it's 50 it's... Pikmin for this. It's probably the biggest ship. It's piece, one of the biggest. If not the biggest. Okay, well thankfully with 50, we're going to be carrying, a, well actually 60, 70! Oh, actually max amount of 70. Anyway. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Look at that thing. Enormous, and it's got running gears. Yes, it does. How are those pieces still operating after nine days while being detached from the rest of the ship? Uh, special life support systems? Beats me. But, <laughs> nine days completely left alone on a planet with no power source. Okay, you And got that machine point. is still running. You got a point, you got a point. That is some amazing technology that these creep that these aliens. Yet have. he doesn't know what half the stuff is for, and he just claims that it's expensive and oh, it's fancy, fancy. Well, it's a good thing it's all automated because I doubt he'd be able to do anything if it wasn't. That's true. Okay, now it would be nice if we had more bomb rocks, but currently now let's actually rescue the Pikmin. There is an easier way to get around. You oh, just go around god. Here. oh my god! I think it's almost, it would only be just, oh no. No, I it's I would say it'd be safer yeah. to just leave them. Oh, apparently there isn't any more Pikmin stuck around. Oh, there is one! You can see it in the background. You see yeah, it. I see him. Hmm. Right. See, that is an important piece. That is true. It takes up half the ship. I have no idea how this works. Like most of your stuff. But it means the dolphin will again lift off with its characteristic roar. 
It's in a Rory. Sure, why not? That's 21 ship parts. Oh, actually, no, they were disbanded. There's one on the other side of the wall. Uh, well, no. Oh, looks like you've got a visitor. Oh, nuts. That's oh. not, it's not a big deal. Just In my opinion, I actually hate Buffy Blowhawks, believe it or not. I love them, they're adorable. Oh, we have conflicting ideas, are we? You do really have Puffy Blowhawk beans. Okay. Now I don't think gonna... it's coming after you, actually. For some, for some weird game physics reason, they're stuck behind a wall. Okay, well, let's see if there are any Pikmin left that I can have for, and I'll look for them in, in the radar. Okay, that'll do it for the day. E pretty much. I'm just gonna Fair see not. if I can get some more bomb marks. Actually, we have all the Pikmin accounted for. No, you don't. You're, they're. Oh. oh, wait. Bam! Oh, never mind. See? All right, okay. I'm good no, no, with don't go for the bomb rocks. If, if you try to pick them up and then take them with you, they'll be left behind on the ground. In fact, mm. I, think they, I think they disappear from the map. You, they disappear from the map? I think so. Well, let's let's get just a few. I just need a few. Are there any? No, I think you took them all. Really? I took every single one? Yeah, and you blow up uh, two walls halfway. Hmm. But they'll respawn tomorrow, right? I think so. I think so, too. Okay, you know what? For the remainder of the day, let's just go back and have I'd some I'd say fun. pick up some random item. The, have the fun! Lollywog. Go for the lollywogs, yeah. Take this back! Back to home base. Here. Dun dun, dun dun. I like the noise that they make while carrying back stuff. At least the Wally Wug will have some use in this stuff. That's right, we kill you for your remains to make more of our army! Oh. That is how it works. That yes. doesn't sound cruel at all. Nope, it's completely ethical. Completely ethical. Actually, I think we have more. The uh, blues, blue cheese Pikmin out of the mustard Pikmin. And we'll let them stay till tomorrow. Yeah. Sounds like a sensible thing. So we had fun today on the first day here at the Distant Spring. Yeah, we collected two ship parts. It's pretty good, actually. Mm -hmm. This is, it wasn't a very eventful day, but it was a nice day to introduce. Yeah, saw some enemies, uh, got used to the map. Mm -hmm. And we actually only this, uh, discovered about one third of the whole map. So. Oh, it's true. There's a lot more. It's a lot more devastating around those places. That's true. Oh, oh, yeah. oh none for you today. On cue, they spread out of the ground. <laughs> I love it that there's one of them that actually screams at, at the ship. It's like, no. No. Nine days since impact. This, there appears to be a large cluster of parts here, if my calculations are correct. This is not back to the future, man. And I should be able to recover virtually all of my sh missing ship parts, but not quite all of them. Unfortunately, there still seem to be some pieces that remain unaccounted for. Oh dear. I must find eight more parts to further increase the dolphin's range. So, we only lost four today. Wow. Not too bad. Huge boom and reds. Yeah, boom and reds, that's for sure. Yep. Yeah. Oh, actually, we still have more yellows than blues. Haha. Uh -huh. Uh, so, pretty good day. Yeah. And Sprout 65 today, mostly reds. Now, for tomorrow, we'll be also gathering two ship parts. Uh, they'll be located more in the inner area of the distant spring. And we'll also be seeing a lovely old friend, and one more new enemy, probably. Okay. But, uh, what you may ask that enemy will be, well, you'll just have to stay tuned for more. So, without further ado, KK signing out, along with my friend, Arduic of Annette. Alright, everyone. See you later. Bye!